Okay, can you guys hear me? Okay, so my name is Delaney. Um, I do the media here at church, um, and I lead the Young Guns with my husband. Um, I've been up here before to share my testimony, and I, I really, I felt called to be baptized, and I wanted to share my story with you guys, if you're up for it. I'm surprised they keep giving me the mic, to be honest. So, um, six years ago, my husband and I moved here, um, and we, we came with $2,000, um, everything we could fit in our vehicle, and a whole lot of hope. And uh, we got here, and we found out that rather than transferring him, um, they terminated him. Um, and fortunately, the manager on this end was Keith Allen. And um, he, he originally told us when we walked in that there wasn't really anything he could do because of the bad situation, but I think he stopped to pray about it. And... I can only imagine God's answer coming like this. Look, I know they're from California, <laughs> but go ahead and love them anyway. <laughs> and he did. And he gave Robbie a job, and I got my first job in Texas through that connection as well. He invited us to church, and I'll be honest, we kind of felt obligated because of the grace that he extended to us. And we came that weekend, and Robbie and I left knowing in our hearts that these were our people and that God called us to Texas. And we were married in that back corner just a few months later and we were baptized by Greg that very same morning. Um, so you're probably wondering why I'm up here again, okay? I was wondering that too when God laid it on my heart. But the day that we were baptized the first time, I didn't really understand the public profession of faith um, I just knew we wanted to start our marriage off right, and I wanted to accept Jesus into my heart in a way that I never had before. And it's been six years, and I have grown in my faith immensely, and I've watched God work miracles in my life. Mm -hmm. I have watched him turn the worst situations into life's biggest blessings. And I've been able to overcome a lifetime of anxiety, crippling depression, suicidal thoughts and self-harm and it's all thanks to Jesus Amen. Amen. but it's it's also thanks to you guys for the acceptance and the encouragement and the love and the prayers from so many people here at top hand and I'm just I'm so overwhelmed and I just I I'm ready for the public profession of faith with my church family, yeah. and I, I just really want to extend a huge thank you to Keith and Emily Allen because we could have crashed and burned in Texas, and because of their walks with Jesus, um, they don't just have faith, they live faith, yeah. and I, I know that they extended grace to us on so many occasions that it was not expected and not deserved but they showed us grace anyway. And for that reason, I've asked Keith to be the one to baptize me today. Amen. And the good thing is, Keith's not even nervous about this. Amen. 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 